Greetings from the Red Sea Diving Safari team. We're joined today by the French free diving group Apne Passion. Uh, they've been coming with us here for the last seven years. Uh, Mr. Gilbert to my right here Hi. is the organizer of this event and we have the team of instructors with us right now. So I'll go ahead and let Gilbert tell us about the free diving program and why they've chosen Marsa Chagra to conduct this workshop. Yeah, in fact, it's a great pleasure for us to be here okay. for the seventh year. In fact, we have the habit to go in this location. This location is very special for us, as you know, uh, because uh, Marsa Chagra Ecology met uh, what we need for to practice freediving. First of all, it's a very protected seashore. Yes. We have always good conditions. And as you know, we need a very flat sea. Yes. Second aspect is a logistic and technical aspect. Uh, we have uh, at our disposition a boat, a dedicated staff, and it's important for our, uh, our team to be all we need. I think about the buoy, I think about the ropes, I think about the ox oxygen, I think about all, all that. Uh, Mr. John Louis is one of the main free diving instructors and he is going to tell us a little bit about the different free diving practices that they're doing. No. In fact, Gilbert told that uh, this place was a very good compromise for the different kind of uh, aims we have with the group we've come here because we have different depth and these depths are corresponding to the the world to the people to go deeper for the most experienced of them or just to discover the feelings and the, 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 the preparation for a good feeling and the water for the real beginners and we have every depth on the same place so they can see each other training at the different levels and it's a very good thing for progressing for the whole group and this group is divided in three main uh, 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 trainees the first one is real beginners. For these beginners, we won't talk about the techniques, just how to prepare and to feel well underwater. The second group is the ones that have acquired some gestures and need to improve to go a little bit deeper. The last part is experienced divers which are here to know what they can really do underwater. They want to have an idea of their own personal depth they can reach and we give them the opportunity to do it in a perfect um, safety. Jean-Louis, if I was a beginner to free diving, yeah. uh, can you just tell me a little bit of how I would begin learning how to free dive? Uh, the first thing we're going to do together is to learn you how to breathe more efficiently. You are used to breathing each day, yes. but you are not used to inflate your lungs in the best way to go down the water with the best air capital inside your lungs. Yes. And this has to be trained. The, the other thing we're going to discuss together is how to begin to dive being very confident in your head. And this is the two main part of your preparation. How to breathe properly and how to relax to go down in the best conditions and to take profit of what is under the water. And I saw that uh, in the morning you guys are carrying out uh, practices, yoga practices. Something which is close to yoga, in the spirit of the yoga, but it's not really yoga. Okay. It's a combination of gestures to uh, warm up the muscles. It's also a combination of a uh, way of breathing to relax and to work on the, the abdom, abdomen muscles. All right, Jerome now is going to give us uh, a briefing about the six free diving practices that they're carrying out. So uh, we, we used to, to practice uh, in the general exercises. You have three main exercises you can do. First is the static, so uh, you can train in pool or in, uh, in the sea. You hold your breath at the surface and you only count the minutes or the seconds. Uh, second one uh, is uh, in depth, so you, you use only your legs and your fins to go down and to come up. Uh, then uh, you can use also a small sled to go down, and then on this sled you have an inflatable uh, balloon so as to come back. Uh, the, thir the third depth uh, exercise is diving without fins, only with, mm, with arms and legs, 
and you can also pull the pull on the rope so as to go down and then to go back. Uh, as Jean-Louis said, we have also real beginners in our groups and uh, it is not uh, easy for them to, to be uh, comfortable in such exercises. We thought about uh, some games in the water, such as uh, walking under the boat, for example. Really nice and fun because people don't think about their, their breathing, their, 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 their lungs and so on. They take fun. And uh, also they are working because without, you know, without thinking about this. Oh, we'd like to thank the Apne Passion team for uh, their workshop that they conducted here. If you guests are interested in learning how to free dive, you can visit our website at www.redsea-divingsafari.com. And uh, we hope you've enjoyed this presentation and we hope that will be a way for more people to become interested in free diving. Thank you.